I'm gonna build the most ridiculous and cool car you've ever seen. And the way I'm gonna do it is with a hamster ball. Now, I don't think anyone has ever made this before, but I think it should work. And actually, our very first step is gonna be building a giant hamster ball. And actually, I think I'm gonna build this entire thing out of glass. Now, that might seem very obvious, but it's for one very good reason. With glass, when you actually look through it, as you can see, other glass blocks disappear, which means it's way easier to make a smooth looking ball. Now, I think our car should be at least that big, so that needs to fit inside of the ball. Now, the whole thing does need to be hollow, so we gotta keep that in mind. Now, honestly, I think I'm just gonna eyeball this. I think like that big, eh, about that big. And actually to make this entire thing way easier to build, I'm actually gonna set the transparency to zero, which kind of turns it into ice, but it just makes it way easier to work on. All right, here we go. So we got two pieces. All we got to do is simply figure out how much we got to scale this, which it's that amount. And then we got to just scale that in all directions. Same on top. All right, there we go. And now we can actually build our ball. Now, before we actually properly start with that, I want to figure out the exact color I want the ball to be because changing it now is going to be a thousand times easier. Because to be honest with you, I really want this to have a plasticky look. And just looking at it like this, these are all vastly different colors you can barely tell the difference so i'm gonna set the transparency down a little bit okay that right there is looking way better okay i think we're gonna go with this one all right then here we go time to start duping now i'm trying to make this ball as smooth as i can so doing a little bit of building trickery here all right there we go so this right here is a ball and what i'm gonna try to do is maybe i'll try to do a little bit of gap filling here just to make the other pieces look good all right so as you can see right here there's a couple blocks overlapping and that would look insanely bad with glass so i think i'm gonna try to fix that all right there we go that is one entire quarter done so we're now gonna gap fill this whole thing so actually another reason that i'm doing this is because we want this thing to roll as smooth as possible and actually doing this just simply gonna make it way smoother and actually if you just wanted to see how much better this is already looking literally these tiny little gaps is what we have now and before it was this train wreck so yeah it is already looking a whole lot better so first we're gonna open this all up a little bit and then just simply fill in what's missing just like so and then all we need is a little bit of rotation zero we should be able to get this perfect all right so now that we have done this all we gotta do is simply take these parts right here and mirror them to the other side so we're gonna grab the mirror tool Bada boom. So movement zero and just make sure that there's no gap there. Just like that, where it's like perfect. All right then, and this piece right here, we're gonna dupe all over the place. So first, let's turn this thing into a full circle. I'm gonna mirror this over to the other side, just like so. 4.32, so we're gonna move the entire thing to the other side by 4.32. There you go, just like that, so that way that gap is filled. And then we're gonna do the exact same thing for the other side. So we're gonna do this right here gonna mirror it delete one and move it by 3.25 so now our little circle thing is just looking a little bit different but this circle right here is gonna be a thousand times cooler now i'm quickly gonna paint this the color that i actually want everything to be because there's a lot of parts right here it's like so all right there it is and now we're just gonna have to dupe this whole thing come on please be perfect yeah there it is baby that is pretty much perfect and i think that right there is the final dupe come on yeah baby dude that looks so good. Oh my God. Okay, let's make this entire thing invisible. Or actually just see through. And as you can see, that just looks absolutely insane. And just simply a thousand times better than if I would have just done this with a regular ball. All right, let's see how well this thing rolls. Okay, I am not heavy enough. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna need a decent amount of weight to actually move this thing. Because, of course, the entire thing is glass. I don't even know if a single thruster would be enough to do it. Yeah, that's not even enough. Oh, God! Come on! Okay, wait. When you attach the thruster, I guess it is enough. <laughs> uh, please? Please let me go? I am Little Hamster. All right, then. Let's bring back our car. Okay, there it is. All right, we're gonna have to move this down until the car is actually touching the glass. Just like so. Now, this thing does need wheels. So, we're gonna have to actually add those real quick. Let's make the entire thing a little bit skinnier. There you go. And then the back wheels. Okay, so currently, it's kind of looking like we're gonna have to move the entire car a little bit up or make the entire thing a little bit smaller. Because, yeah, right now, it's just a little bit too big. So, there is gonna be our car. And actually, this car needs to be really really heavy because of course um, the actual ball is insanely heavy too so i think i might put like 10,000 metal blocks in here so there's one block and i'm just gonna simply move this out and start cloning it over here all right so here we have about a thousand metal blocks i think that should be enough actually wait uh, i'm gonna make them invisible because <laughs> metal honestly isn't my favorite block i think it's a little bit ugly and it looks like i actually managed to not place the car in the middle like an absolute moron it needs to be in the exact middle okay there you go 
And there you go. Okay, perfect. Then what I'm going to do next up is going to be pretty cool. So I'm going to take myself a bar. I'm going to place it right here facing downwards. I'm going to have the other piece attached right here. Just like so. I think that's perfect. And then we just got to make sure that this bar is correctly attached to the build. And actually, the way I'm going to do that, I think I'll just use two metal rods. All right, there we go. And actually, I'm going to make this collision off. Okay, we can delete that. And I think... This right here is actually going to be our car done. Uh, I do think I actually need a chair, though. There we go. All right, then let's see if this entire thing is even going to work. <laughs> okay, so yeah, right now we're just kind of hanging here. So I'm going to turn off match rotation. Okay, we are dangling now. I'm going to set the length to a little bit longer. Okay, we're still dangling. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, my God. Oh, da, 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 da. I have set the speed to too high. I spent... I, <laughs> uh... <laughs> Okay, wait, it is working, but I have made a grave mistake. <laughs> Dude, this is actually working. Dude, this is so cool. <laughs> Dude, I'm trying to control it. Dude, look at this car! Okay, we're gonna set the wheel speed a little bit lower, because currently it is just simply too high. But we, we're actually rolling the ball! <laughs> wait! Because the ball is just so perfectly balanced, this thing work is working insanely well. Now, on the inside here, this thing... Yeah, it's currently in an angle limit of 90. I gotta set that to, like... So that way, I can just simply roll around this ball forever. And I'm never gonna run out of space. Dude, I feel like little hamster. <laughs> Dude, I don't care what anyone says. This is officially the coolest car you've ever seen. <laughs> it is a little bit hard to steer. Like, it doesn't really want to go the other way very often, but I think I could actually fix that with using a pilot seat. Hello, everybody. I'm coming back. Actually, I think I might want to set the speed of the wheels just a little bit higher. Currently, it's 20. I'm going to set it to 30. Yeah, now we're... Yeah, baby, that is exactly what I wanted to see. We can go way quicker now. <laughs> dude, look at me doing... Look at me doing front flips, dude. <laughs> He's like, what? What kind of car is that? Oh, dude, he's got a plane. Uh oh, I'm going to nudge him on accident. Uh, I don't mean to. I don't mean to. Hello, dude. Do you want to take a ride? Now, I will say, I think this would actually work if you build a simpler ball, but it just works so much better because the ball is just so smooth. All right, I got him a chair. Come here, brother. I got a chair for you. Hop on. <laughs> oh, wait, I have isolation mode turned on. Oops, oh, wait, I got it. Gonna let him in first. Okay, there you go. Okay, he's in my ball. <laughs> oh my god, dude. Dude, imagine this is his first day playing build a boat. If he sees this, I mean, this guy never stops playing. I can tell you right now. What is this? It is another car. Wanna ride my car? Yeah. All right, you know what? I'm actually gonna let him drive it just, to, just so you guys can see. This thing actually drives insanely well. All right, we got a couple of people in here. <laughs> and we only have two chairs, three people. Uh oh. <laughs> it don't work. What do you mean it don't work? You're driving the car. Bro, I guess maybe this dude is just a little bit blind. Oh, God, I'm being thrown around. The hey, stop it, dude. You're a hamster, lol. Dude, this build is so sick. 